everyone, so I've got a pretty quick video for you today. I mentioned in my last video that I had more unboxings to film, and here we are. Today I'm going to be unboxing Bookcase Club. I actually already did my first unboxing video for Bookcase Club, and I'll link that down below if you want to watch it and learn more about them. But basically, Bookcase Club is a new monthly book subscription box service um, that includes two books for $9.99 plus $5 shipping. You can choose from eight subscription themes, um, and they also donate a book to charity with each new and renewing subscription. I'll have all their information down below, so make sure to check it out if you're interested. Also, if you are interested, um, I have a coupon code which is Molly15. You can save 15% off your subscription, which is a pretty good deal. Anyway, on to the unboxing. I'm telling you, I'm getting better at opening these boxes on camera. I'll let you see it first. Dun, 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 all right, we've got a letter first, and it says, I don't think of all the misery, but of the beauty that still remains. Anne Frank, Diary of a Young Girl. We hope your holidays are filled with warmth, food, and family, along with the time to enjoy these things. With all the hustle and bustle of the season, be sure to set aside some time to dive into our latest book selections. That's sweet. Okay, so here are our two books. We've got The Book of You. Ooh, cool cover. Um, and this is by Claire Kendall. I really like the way this one feels. The little blurb um, in the letter says, every story has a true name. I wish this story's name could be different, but nothing will change it. This story is the book of you. Okay, so the first thing that I read on this book is actually um, a little blurb from Entertainment Weekly. And it says, minutes after you dip into Kendall's novel, you'll know what it's like to be a woman who's being stalked. By the end, your heart will thump and your shirt will get clammy with nervous sweat. Creepy. Okay, so I'm reading the back of this book and already it's giving me um, the whole ICU kind of vibes. It's about a girl named Clarissa and a man named Rafe or Rafi um, is everywhere. She turns at work, her apartment, at the park. I would say it differs from ICU in that um, she knows that he's stalking her and that he's totally fixated on her um, and she is trying to escape. Masterfully constructed with riveting tension and a haunting sense of menace, Claire Kendall's extraordinary debut, this is a debut, very cool, um, explores the lines between obsession and love, offering a heart-stopping portrait of a woman determined to survive. Okay, this is awesome. So it's a literary thriller, um, but it's also kind of like a survival book, and it looks like she has a love interest in this book as well. So, very cool, I'm interested in this. I haven't heard of it. Let me know down below if you've um, heard of it. And the next book, dun dun dun, Greg Hurwitz, Don't Look Back, New York Times bestselling author of The Survivor. The blurb in this letter says, as she scrambled to find her feet in the moist vegetation, she knew she couldn't afford to search for the camera. The time for hunting was over, now she was the prey. Ooh, that sounds super interesting. This is like a huge, heavy hardback. Like, so it looks like this one's all about suspense and terror and survival and death. Seems maybe similar to the other book. Oh my gosh, this sounds so creepy. Okay, so it's about this girl named Eve who's a newly single mother of one. She's on a trip rafting and hiking in Mexico. She wanders off trail and comes across this shack where this guy is um, throwing machetes at human-shaped targets. I guess she finds this camera that used to belong to this woman named Teresa Hamilton. She soon discovers that Teresa Hamilton has been missing and there are these photos of this menacing man throwing machetes on this camera that she found. I guess it didn't go unnoticed by this creepy dude um, that someone was snooping around his shack. So yeah, it sounds like a hunting a uh, story, a story of survival, danger, suspense. I really like reading survival um, sort of suspense uh, thrillers because my mind just doesn't work that way. Like if I were in the Hunger Games, I would absolutely be the first to die. Like there's no question. So I always find it interesting when writers can create these characters who are just so resilient and um, use their wits and their resources to survive. I just think those stories are so cool and adventurous, but Anyway, those are my two books from Bookcase Club. I love them. I still can't believe that they send two books and one is like a serious hardback. Thanks so much Bookcase Club for 
um, sending me this box to review on my channel. And yeah, if you're interested in this subscription, um, all the links will be down below. Use my code Molly15. Hope your December is going well and I'll talk to you later. Bye.